conversation with your uncle about playing in big games? No, I never – we never really talk football. We haven't talked football in a while. Uh, people ask me that all the time, but – no, we, we, whenever we talk, it's more about he's bringing me some pickled okra or something we're talking about going fishing or something. <laughs> Heading into this game, after all the big guy, big games you guys played in last year, does it feel different at this point last year when you got you know AC Championship last year, the Rose Bowl, the National Championship under your belt this year? Um, I don't know. To me, it's, it's a little different for me. I, I missed the, the National Championship for my broken leg, so it's a little different. Um, but at the same time, I mean, it's it's – you know, it's another game. It's a really big game. It's a it's kind of a – I don't want to say it's a rematch, even though it is, but, you know, we're, we're playing for the SEC championship again, and so it's a real big game. Um, Charlie, I mean, even though you all say, you know, it's the same type of game, there's got to be an extra level of hype around it when you all get in there Saturday. So is there a point during the game where that all goes away and it's about executing and just – you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. No, I think it goes right away in the – First kickoff. I mean, you know, I mean, we, that's how we practice all week is just to be sound and execute. You know, during the during the game, and you know, with, we we practice with crowd noise to get used to it, and you know, the, all the with all the hype around it, and uh, really just right when the game starts, it's like, all right, let's, let's lock in, and let's, let's, let's go execute our plays we worked all week, and uh, really all year to this point, you know, to execute and win the SEC, SEC championship again. I know Was you're not a social media guy. We talked about that last time, but. I got to think it's kind of hard to escape all the talk. I mean, it seems like every time you turn on TV or turn around, somebody's talking about it. How? I mean, is it something that, that you soak in and enjoy, or is it something you block out? Uh, me, I, I block out. That's a big reason why I don't have social media. But at the same time, when I do hear about it on like TV or whatever, uh, I just kind of block it out and you know, don't don't really pay attention to uh, all the big hype around it. What was the uh, flight back from California like? With, with a broken leg, was it uncomfortable? Oh, it was horrible. Yeah, I didn't enjoy it. I mean, do they, how did they accommodate that? Just, well, they don't. Uh, I can't. I can't honestly can't remember. It was just everything happened so quick. You know, the, the, the whole game. We were on a we were in a rush on the way back because the whole celebration took forever. We had to really hurry back. I just I just thought I was in pain. What was the nine days like, knowing that you weren't going to play? And I mean, how'd you get through that? It. I don't know. I was kind of in shock the whole time. You know what I mean? Because I had the first time I ever had an injury like that in my career, and it was just kind of. You know, it really, it sucked, but I mean, it's, um, I don't know, it didn't really hit me until like, honestly, after the national championship that it, that it was that bad. Did you play the, I mean, did 